I'm Ben with the BTC Sessions, and this is your Lightning Session brought to you by Voltage, offering enterprise grade infrastructure services for Bitcoin like hosted nodes, BTC Pay servers, and inbound liquidity. You can check them out now at voltage.cloud. What is a Bitcoin block explorer and how do you use one? A block explorer is a tool that allows you to audit individual transactions, individual addresses, or entire blocks of transactions that have been mined on the Bitcoin blockchain. Some examples of popular block explorers are blockchain.com, blockchair.com, blockstream.info, and my favorite, mempool.space. Here on mempool.space, at the top you will see in red any blocks that are yet to be mined on the network, as well as in blue, any blocks that have previously been mined recently. Down below, you'll see various stats like fees that you should attach based on transaction priority, Bitcoin difficulty, fee charts, incoming transactions, latest blocks, and latest transactions. Let's say I wanted to look up a particular transaction on mempool.space. I can click on said transaction, click on details in the top right, and then copy the transaction ID back over on mempool.space, and I will see all of the details of my transaction, including when it took place, what block it was in, the fee attached, the fee rate in sats per byte, the features used, and inputs and outputs. If I want to look up an individual Bitcoin address, I can paste whichever one I like in the search bar. Upon searching this, I will see the address in question, the total amount received to the address and sent from the address, the current balance, and any transactions broken down below. I can also look up individual blocks by typing in the block number in question, or if it's a recent one, simply clicking on the block in question. This will show me a full list of transactions that were mined in that particular block. To start playing around with mempool.space yourself, just head to their website, mempool, M-E-M-P-O-O-L dot space.